actually need to replace your cylinder liner. Have you ever been thinking of going to replace it? If you see three things, these three things I'm going to mention right in your cylinder liner or sleeve, you should immediately replace it. When you see a crack, when you see a scoring, and when you see a fretting, these three things you must replace your cylinder. As soon as you see these three things, right, it, is, it will be visible to you, then your cylinder, your liner must be replaced. You must replace your liner. With these three things, replace your, your liner. When these things are present, it's still telling you that your liner or your sleeve is damaged and it must be replaced. In my previous video, which I will drop in this link, in this description, I will drop the link in the description, you will see what actually causes your cylinder liner, what causes damages. So, when you see these three things, you should know that you need to replace it. And sometimes, when these things are not present, you should remember that the more your engine is working, the bow of your cylinder is becoming wider. In fact, the 0 .0 0 0.01 as per 1000 running hour of your engine is going out of your engine ball. So the more your cylinder is, the more your sleeve is working, the more your engine is working, the more your ball is becoming wider. And when your ball is becoming wider, then your cylinder is becoming weary. And when it is weird, you need to replace it. When the damage is not visible, then you can go to your engine manual. In your engine manual, the manufacturer will stipulate how many hours you need to replace your engine sleeve or your cylinder liner. When you see it, please follow through as your manufacturer instructed. Because sometimes the ball of your cylinder is becoming wider and it becomes, it can lead to something serious if it is not replaced. So when you are doing total overhauling, measure your cylinder ball and notice if it's becoming too much. Go to your, check your engine manner, what it should be. Or you consult a professional to help you to gauge or measure your cylinder ball and the ovality. Then it will help you to know if you need to replace your engine man, your engine sleeve. So you are using the physical damage, and also you want to tweet, you want to go ahead with your manner, what your manner tells you. If you inspect and you see a physical damage on your engine. Then you are replacing it. I mentioned those three physical damage. You see scoring, you see fretting, or if you see the, the other one on it, then you should know that you are replacing. But even at like that, when you are not seeing something visible on your sleeve, then you should try to measure the ball of your sleeve. If the ball is becoming wider or out of the range, then you need to replace. Do well to consult your manufacturer manual or the owner manual. It will tell you the actual ball of your cylinder and the, the running hour or the work hour your cylinder should be replaced. So if you notice that your engine has run to that extent, the run the running hour, you should try to replace your engine sleeve or cylinder liner by this so you have a good engine that is running very well and uh, you don't have much of the engine when you are doing your total overhauling you can do it to replace your engine sleeve if it if you notice those conditions that was earlier mentioned a crack is scoring or is coughing you see any of them, then you replace your cylinder sleeve or your engine liner. 
Thank you for listening to me. I'm Mr. Engine. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video.